Hello and welcome back to Timmy's 10 again for an unboxing of a brand new Hot Wheels car. Today we have one here that I scored at Target right on the shelf. It was just hanging there and I thought it was really cool. It was just with all the other blue ones, which means it came out of the box with them. It is a 70 Ford Escort RS 1600, but it's also a Hot Wheels ID car. Number two of eight. Uniquely identifiable vehicles with all that killer paint job. And there is an app that you can check on your car and see how it is doing. All right, now I'm not gonna pretend I know what I'm talking about on that because I really don't. I don't do apps and I don't play these car race games, but it does sound really cool. I'm here to review the car. I believe this car was out on the shelf in 2020. I got it a couple years ago. I've been saving it in a bubble because at the time it was the first one I had ever scored. I've also found a Batmobile since then. And I found many in the box. The ID cars in the box, those were easy to find. It was on the J hooks that were hard to find. All right, let's get this out. This should have some spe special paint job, which does not say that on the package, but I mean, you can see it right there. Wow, that is just amazing, <laughs> amazing paint job. Anybody that's into Hot Wheels would understand why this paint job is really, really cool. It'd be better if that hood opened. Steering is on the right. And this is some rally car, it's number 53. So it must be a different country than America that they're rally car in a rally race in this car. And you'll notice all my mistakes that I make in my videos. Everything is raw. Nothing embarrasses me because you know what? Nobody else does it. Nobody else has videos that they don't edit, pause, add music. Mistakes included, that's what I'm saying. Me being real. That's where it's the best. All right, let's see how it rolls. There's the bottom, look at that bottom. Way different than any car you've ever seen. All four car, uh, wheels roll well. Very straight roll, look at that, that is amazing. And I thought I wanted it to have rubber tires, but I'm glad it don't because, wow. I want to race this guy. This guy is really cool. Definitely don't want to mess up the paint job. Oh, that's awesome. That was cool. So I'm not going to do too much bouncing around on the ball. I don't want it smashing. Some cars I don't care. See, I don't even want that to happen. Some cars I just don't care. But this one I do. It's not going to get messed up too much. It's not going to mess up at all, really. I'm not really smashing it around. But man, do I like it. Thank you, everybody, that tuned in and check this out. Please subscribe to Timmy's 10 again. And this is going into my favorites case in case anybody's wondering. Yeah, this is like a paint job that I can't imagine letting get messed up in any way at all. I'm going to put this in a soft penny sleeve from Trading Cards, tape that up, and then put it in my favorites case. Thanks for tuning in and checking it out. Please subscribe. Until next time, T10 out.